guys, it's Glit Sisters, and I'm going to show you how to do the fishtail bracelet. It's a rainbow and fishtail bracelet. I am going to be using the loom today. Um, but, I mean, yeah, I'm going to be using right, the loom right, today. So you will need a loom, but you will only need two pegs. It's the same as my inverted fishtail tutorial, but I haven't made an inverted fishtail tutorial, so it makes no sense. So, yes. Okay, so we need two pegs from the rainbow loom. I'm going to be using these two pegs. You will also need being a crochet hook. You can use the rainbow loom hook by June's design, um, or you can use a regular metal crochet hook. It doesn't matter. You will need um, a C clip or an S clip or no clip. Doesn't matter either. Um, and you will need colors. I'm gonna use three, so I'm gonna use pink. It's kind of hard to see on camera. You will be needing green also. Sorry, it's just lighting. This really is green. It's not a minty color, but I do like the color. It's like a mint color. Um, then I'm going to be using clear, which you can see perfectly, which I don't get. Well, whatever. So, get your rainbow loom ready. Get your hook ready. C-clip ready. And how many colors you want? I don't care. It doesn't really matter. But this is what the fishtail is going to look like. It's not going to look just like this because I made this randomly. Okay. Nope. This is what it's going to look like when you're sure. done. Yep. These are tiny colors, so you can't really see them. Okay. So first, you're going to start with your rainbow loom and your crochet up and color I'm going to start out with pink and you're going to get it and you're going to twist sorry you're going to get it and you're going to twist it into a figure eight just like this as I'm showing you on camera then I'm going to put a band normally over it just like this and put another rubber band over it just normal then what you're going to do is you're going to grab the bottom of the band with your hook put up and over bottom of the band with your hook and put it up and over. So now it looks just like that. Just back a little. Okay. Now, if you use three colors, you're going to get the top or band color. Mine's pink, and you're going to put it over like this. Grab the bottom rubber band, put it up and over, bottom of band, put it up and over. Push it down. Put another band, put it over. Uh, event, um, eventually you'll see it grow and you'll just need to pull it out. Like, if it was growing from here, you'll just need to pull it out that way and it would just grow longer and longer. I'm showing you up close so you get it. Alright. So much for that idea. Push it down. Get another rope band, put it on your loom, get the bottom band up and over the bottom band. What for you, lady? What'd you bring? Just for this trip, okay? Okay. So, so cute. Oh, that is cute! So you can, you can draw on it, okay? Okay, thank you. Thanks. Make sure of your brother. Okay. Um, then get another rope band, put it over, that one is twist, put it over, bottom of band, put it up and over, bottom of band, put it up and over, push it down, get another rope band, you can come up with your own two peg figure, you can use push pins, pencils, um, two crochet hooks, Fingers, pegs, you can actually um, 
with, um, use the mini loom for this. You can actually go on the Rainbow Loom website and get rubber bands. I don't think it comes with the full attached loom, but mine is starting, my Rainbow Loom bracelet is starting to grow. So you're going to get it from this eight and just pull it. Now mine's starting to look like that a little bit. Um, my pink looks like orange on screen. It's weird. Um, but get the bottom rubber band, put up and over, bottom up band, put up and over. So basically you're doing this till the end of your rainbow and bracelet. Super simple, super easy. And this takes me about two minutes to I don't know how long it will take you. It might take you a long time when you start to do this, but mine's starting to get a lot of length for now. I've only been working on it for not long, actually. So mine's starting to get length. Let's just continue. So if you didn't get what I did, the first part, rewind the video and just watch it because I'm pretty sure I gave really clear instructions. And if I did not, I'm, it's not my fault, I swear. Well, I don't really swear. I'm just serious. My wrist isn't that very that big, isn't that very big. So I'm going to make this a small bracelet because I actually have to leave a little bit. As you can see, mine is pretty long. It is not long enough for my wrist, but my wrist is small, so 
so I'm just going to go with it. First, I'm going to loop these other rubber bands that I have left. Oh my gosh, clumsy. rubber band that you want then what you're gonna do is there's supposed to be two rubber bands left on these two pegs I don't know if you can see but grab the bottom clear that's my color clear and then I'm gonna take this pink from this side pull it over to this peg You don't need your hook anymore. You don't need any bands any anymore. You don't need any more little bands. So you don't need your hook. You don't need your loom after we're done with this part. Put the C clip on. Sorry. Put the C clip on. So now it looks like that. So put it in the groove. Then take it off the loom. And it's nothing broke. You don't need you don't need your ring loom anymore. Set that aside. You don't need. Put your color rubber bands away. your little clip from this side and attach it to this capped band on this side. There you have your awesome fishtail. So make sure to watch, um, that's what it looks like on, with my inverted fishtail. It actually fits and it's tiny and look how big it is small. And now look how big this inverted fishtail is. Pretty small. That's how big my wrist is. It's like a baby. But I'm 10. I'm from the Queen Sisters channel. Make sure to watch. Make sure to subscribe, like, and comment on this video. Um, subscribe right here on YouTube. You can Comment down below what you would like us to make next. Is that um, big enough for Aunt Kristen? What? Is that big enough for Aunt Kristen? No, not yet. For wrist? No, not yet, but I'm almost done with it. Um, I will have the inverted fishtail up tonight. Hopefully. Um, but I'm going to be in a different location. I'm in Sedona right now, and we're going to be here for two days, starting today. Um, this is what they look like. I'm nursed. So thank you guys for watching. I will have the Dragon Scale Cuff Bracelet up. And just to let you guys know, if you ever want us to make a hexafish, um, we can't make a hexafish because it's just a ton of our bands. And last time we made a hexafish, it broke in the middle of when I was almost done. And I got very mad. So. What? Oh, yeah, we don't have any, do we? I didn't pack any of that stuff.
but um, yeah, well, um, you can ask us to make on the rainbow loom tutorials. Okay, it starts at five. That's right. Not really. Hi, my hair is oily. I need to wash it. Do you have any shampoo? Do you have any shampoo? See ya. Bye.